Hello everyone, my name is Setos and I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you how to make rosemary hair spray. Rosemary has so many benefits for the hair. It relieves dryness and itchiness of the scalp. It's a great treatment for dandruff and it can even help with hair growth by stimulating circulation to the scalp. There was a study done that proved that rosemary is just as effective as minoxidil aka Rogaine at restoring hair growth. Now we know the benefits of rosemary for hair let's start making it first off we'll bring two cups of water to boil and then we will just add in our handful of rosemary in it now I will lower the temperature I'm also going to add some fresh peppermint leaves into it mint is rich in menthol and very healthy for our scalp it creates a cool and calm effect when applied and can even treat irritated skin I'm making this tea in a small quantity you can add just the quantity as required you can also make it in a large quantity to use it as a hair rinse. Now once the tea is ready, you can transfer it to a spray bottle. Now I'm going to tell you how to use the spray to get the maximum benefit. Right after the sour, spray this rosemary water into clean and wet hair. As we learned earlier, rosemary is beneficial for the scalp and hair follicles, so it's important to ensure the rosemary water has gotten into the scalp. You can use this hairspray every day morning or evening as much as you like. This herbal tea will refresh your hair. I usually like to spray once a day on scalp after finishing the workout to refresh my hair. Massaging the rosemary water into the scalp is very helpful. So after applying make sure you massage your scalp for a minimum of 5 minutes. After applying the rosemary water you may proceed as usual. This means the treatment should not be rinsed out. Let your hair air dry after applying it. You can also use this tea as a hair rinse on your wash day. Basically in that method you just rinse your hair with rosemary water as a last step of your hair wash. And you let the tea sit in your hair and letting your hair air dry after that. I recommend you to use this at least two times a week to see the results. This is what my hair looked after using the rosemary spray. So this is it for today's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please let me know if you end up trying this in the comment section below. Bye now. See you in the next one.